Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you the trades that were posted on Monday, 20th of November 2023. These trades were shared by PM who is trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see the macro chart which was in the sideways range broke up. Using the structural chart also you can see the uptrend channel and the area of pullback. So he used one minute trading chart and identified several areas of long entries and entered and managed them and closed with exit strategy number one with high win rate and profit. So thank you PM for sharing your trades with us. The next trade was shared by Yasin who is trading S&P 500 futures. As you see the macro chart is an uptrend and you can see also the uptrend channel in the structural chart with good momentum. So using a smaller trading chart he identified this area of entry based on algo 1 to 5 and managed and closed it with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you Yasin for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by ES who is trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see the macro chart is in uptrend. So using a structural chart of 5 minutes, she waited for the complex pullback to be completed and when it broke up, she entered two long position based on algo 1 to 5 and managed and closed them with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you yes for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by Sam or Global Instructor from Australia who is trading Gold USD. As you see the macro chart reached an area of static resistance and the price got rejected. You can see the downtrend channel in the structural chart here. So he entered two sell short position here with setup C and managed and closed this in the middle of the channel with good risk to reward ratio and profit. And you see the result of his trades here. So thank you Sam for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by Yan or Global Instructor who is trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see the macro chart which was in the sideways range broke up and we can see also the uptrend channel in the structural 5 minute chart with good momentum. So using 1 minute trading chart he identified area of pullback and entry based on algo 1 to 5 and enter two long position and manage and close them with exit strategy number 1 with profit. So thank you Yan for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you the trades that I have taken today on Monday 20th of November 2023. These trades were taken on Nasdaq, Dow Jones and S&P 500 futures. If you look at the one hour macro chart, we see that the price was fluctuating around the previous day low on all eminis during the global session and it started to go up during the London session and tested the previous day high on all eminis and point of control and during the New York market session there was a slight pullback and then the buyers came back strongly and pushed the price high so when there was a pullback around 9.50 there was opportunity to enter long positions with setup T on Nasdaq and also Dow Jones and I took several long positions here and again the price had retracement and came back and retested this level again around 10.20 so that's the time I took two long position on S&P 500 and these signals were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader funds accounts and you see the performance of one of the accounts that shows profit factor of 99 which is infinite because we had 100% win rate from the long positions taken so the average winning trades were about $60 and the largest winning trade was $175 so I hope these trades taken by the PAT system is useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.